results matter, call a hometown firm that delivers. Call Sweet James. Today in L.A. with Robin Winston, weekday mornings. We've been talking about a low turnout for this election, but we heard from voters about how important it was for them to come out. NBC4's Macy Jenkins spoke with voters just before the polls closed. Yep. Yep. There you go. Just 30 minutes before the polls closed, we found a packed house at the North Hollywood Recreation Center with last minute voters scurrying to cast their ballots. I mean, there are some countries where you have to vote, and I'm like, yeah. I took the time, I studied, and I made it here before eight. Some say they got caught up with work. Oh, usually we do it ahead of time and drop it off at the drop box, but we just weren't on top of it this year. And others. No, I was just lazy. I waited at the last minute. And many of them less concerned about the race for the White House and more focused on matters close to home. I have to say it's the Senate race. Well, you know, gee, I think this is going to be a game changer for the state of California. Feinstein was in office for a very long time. So I think whomever gets in the office, it's so important that we get the right person in the office. It is important because I'd like to see some changes in L.A. County. Um, I want more people to have affordable housing. Those 644 vote centers in L.A. County alleviating the stress some voters have faced in years before. It was good. The process was good. I mean, in the past, voting has been such a nightmare. I mean, huge long lines. So the easier you make it, the better. That was Macy Jenkins. Keep in mind, the polls have only been closed for three and a half hours, yeah. so they are still counting and will be for quite a while. More coverage tomorrow on Today in L.A. Yes, and thanks for joining us tonight for this Super Tuesday election coverage. The Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon is up next.